Time for an update. This is Mac Voices. Welcome to Mac Voices. This is the talk of the Apple community, and I'm Chuck Joyner. And folks, this is the February 2021 update. Surprise, I'm actually getting it in before the very end of the month. I've been trying to hit these a little bit closer to the middle, and the scheduling doesn't always work out, but this time it worked out almost perfectly. So this is going to be right here in the middle of February, uh, a cold February here in the Northeast. Um, and I guess the I guess the bad news in a way is there's not a lot to talk about. We wrapped up a lot of our CES coverage um, at the end of January and slid a little bit into February. There's still some folks I'm trying to pursue as far as scheduling to get them on, and so those shows would be labeled with CES if and when we get them to happen. Uh, the other thing I'm working – I've been working on a number of different – Behind the scenes projects, and frankly, it didn't make much headway this uh, this month. Um, it was one of those two steps forward, one step back kind of month that just didn't happen. But slowly but surely, there will be some some new things, um, and especially for our Patreon supporters. But more on that once it actually happens. The other thing I wanted to just bring up uh, briefly. And I've talked about it a number of times here is Mac Voices Live on Tuesday nights, 8 p.m. Eastern, 5 p.m. Pacific on both Facebook and YouTube. And it's been very interesting to watch how things develop. Our Facebook uh, live viewership has pretty much stayed steady, you know, not a whole lot of folks for whatever reason. The YouTube viewership, however, has jumped, even though that was launched a lot later. Uh, it seems like more people are willing to dive onto YouTube and enjoy the show. So I want your help, if you if you will, in trying to promote that show and promote it on YouTube. Promote it on Facebook, too, of course. But um, promote the idea that with YouTube, you don't have to have to log in necessarily. And I think that may be the big differentiating factor. The other thing that's happened with Mac Voices, it happened last time. In fact, it just happened this past week, and you'll see some of those shows that will come out next week. We've been targeting 60 minutes for the live show, and the panels just kind of keep going on and on, and a lot of times we lose track of time. But more importantly, as we get larger panels, there's more for them to say. So I want to continue to try to keep the shows a little bit shorter than they historically have been. Um, and that means chopping some of the Facebook Live shows, excuse me, the Mac Voices Live shows, um, chopping them up into into smaller the smaller increments, which meet the guidelines, and then just stretching them out over three shows. So I hope that that meets with your approval. I'd love to hear from you one way or another what you think. The whole idea is to make those little bits and pieces a bit more palatable, but a little, little bit easier to consume on a daily basis um, rather than just the hour-long massive shows. So we'd love to have your feedback on that, chuck at macvoices.com, and your feedback on everything uh, related to Mac Voices anytime. Um, Guest suggestions, comments, criticisms, you know, whatever. The old saying is, if you like what we do, tell somebody else. If you don't like what we do, tell me. And I would ag I agree with that. So please, if there's something going on that you like, yeah, I'd, I would like to hear it too. But tell everybody you know. And if there's something you don't like, then please let me know and we can kick it around as to why it's being done that way and maybe affect a change. Or maybe you'll understand better about why it's done that way. So with that, uh, we'll go to the February support report. This time, we had no PayPal supporters for the month, but um, in our Patreon uh, program, can't say program, our Patreon program, we had nobody at Platinum, but at Gold, we had David G. and Frank P. At Silver, we had Bobby, Chuck A., Michael D., Bruce E., Tim G., Chuck P., Hal P., George R., Daniel S., and Newt S. And at Bronze, we have Max C, Tom C, Greg H, Clinton M, John M, and Prop P. And just a quick reminder, if you signed up after January 31st, then you will show up in next month's support report because Patreon doesn't charge uh, until the first of the month. So your your support would not be collected until, in this case, March 1st. Just so you know, I don't want to have anyone think that we miss them because we really, really appreciate each and every one of you, no matter what level of support you offer. And of course, this is the point in the show where I say, if you 
can't support us through Patreon, we completely understand. You can support us other ways by writing reviews, giving us thumbs up or retreat retweets or reposts on the social medias. Um, you can uh, write reviews and in iTunes. That definitely helps. And you can always, uh, if you're buying things from Amazon, buy through the links on our site. That too gives us a little kickback. Doesn't cost you anything, but definitely helps uh, support Mac Voices. So that wraps up this month's update. I hope to see you back here in March uh, and definitely in between on all the episodes of Mac Voices and especially on Mac Voices Live on Facebook and YouTube. Until the next time, and as always, thanks for watching. Visit macvoices.com for show notes and to connect with Chuck on social media. Get involved in our Facebook group or like our Facebook page and get more out of your Apple tech with Mac Voices Magazine, free on Flipboard and on the web. And if you find value in it all, consider supporting us through either our Patreon campaign at patreon.com slash macvoices or by making a one-time donation via the PayPal link on our front page and in the show notes of each episode. You will join these fine people who help bring you Mac Voices. Advertising handled by Backbeat Media at backbeatmedia.com. Bandwidth provided by Cashfly at cashfly.com.